Let me go to you on this, Jeff Nathan. So we've got Lynn Genoff bragging. I'm a member of Mossad. You're right. Uh, Playboy Enterprises. On and on and on. But the rabbi, he, he can't help that he's a liar. All right? That's his nature. But the rabbi choose to go to bed with him. The rabbi choose to befriend him and take him into his fold and become one of his best friends. So what does that tell us about the rabbi? You know, a guy comes up to me and says, hey, I was a hitman for the Mossad. Honey, I'm turning around and walking the other way. I don't want to be around any hitman, okay, unless I'm prosecuting him. But here, the rabbi actually took him in. And I don't mean in a religious sense. I mean in a sense where he began to hang out with him. He became a confidant of the rabbis. Right, Nancy. In fact, there's a saying in the criminal defense business that if you sleep with dogs, you're going to get fleas, and that's precisely what happened <laughs> My grandmother in this said, instance. lay down with a dog, wake up with a flea. Well, okay. this is what we have in this instance, and I think what's uh, going to come out may be in the background of this thing also is that when you're in a contract killing scenario, is that not only may there be this upfront $30,000 payment, but down the line, that contract killer is going to come back and haunt you and bite you just like a flea and want more dough. And that's when you'll to find the people, yeah, to be quiet. And that's when, when you'll find everything starts to unravel because the well, snitch won't keep his deal. You know, he's got to get.